I'm my aunt Shaw. I'm from Louisiana, born and raised, and uh, now I'm here in New York working in data science. I was working at Facebook and I was kind of like on an Instagram team that was looking at spam and trying to control spam. And we were looking at the flags for that. And I was realizing that I was passing that data to someone and they were creating an algorithm. And those algorithms sometimes would do not kind of what I thought they should do or what you know some other people on our team thought they should do. And it felt like a world like we didn't understand. So I just wanted to get more involved with it. I started learning some more, learning some more. And then I realized I needed like an intensive environment, you know, where you learn basically 12 weeks straight, like you know, the academy has. And so I joined basically to get to that point where I would have more control over those systems and I wouldn't be like the input, but I'd also be the output. There was one project that I really felt I excelled at and it made me more excited about data science and that was predicting how many people would attend a rental inquiry. So it's like if somebody posts a, a listing for a, an apartment in New York, how many people are gonna attend that listing? And so it was a Kaggle competition and we were just trying to predict it. And at first I was predicting it all the usual ways. I got into um, creating an XG boost model and just took all the numbers that were there, removed all the text and just like ran it, you know, and try to see what happened. And then I started to get more interested in thinking about it. Like if I lived in New York, where would I want to live? You know, uh, I would want to live near a subway station. And so I put a distance to subway station in there. So it was like a number like 150 feet to subway station or 250 feet to a subway station. And then I was thinking, well, if I'm near a subway station, but there's only one line, how much does that help me? But if I'm near like Union Square, that's huge. So I, there's a number like 100 feet away from station. Then I made it so it was like divided by how many lines are there. So it was like a smaller is better to this number kind of metric. And that made my model like run really fast. It was like, not fast, but really uh, high, um, productivity, it had a really high accuracy. In my job search, the Academy was super helpful. They are they help you one on one with your specific applications and then they also you know send uh, possible openings to everyone in your cohort. So you have a good idea of what may fit your specific skill set and what may fit someone else's skill set and helps you kind of decide where you fit within the whole like group of data science. In the academy, there were a lot of good memories. I think the best ones are when you work in large groups and everyone helps each other and you guys get through a problem that maybe you couldn't previously solve or you break through. Usually it's whenever you're working in a, in a large project that you run into problems that you've never seen before. And you know, a lot of coding is ultimately not gonna be um, taught to you directly. It's like that you're taught how to learn. So when you break through, and that's usually the best time. <laughs>